Episode 16, Making an Impact with 8th Grade Secret Agents. Students in Ms. Blackwood's ELA class just wrapped up a fun project, but shh, it's a secret. Someone let her tell you about it. Okay, so we were trying to support social studies and they were studying the American Revolution. So we took them to spy school. So we needed a nonfiction unit where they could read. So the culminating project for spy schools, after they learned about spies, all the different techniques they use, all the ways that they helped the American Revolution become successful, is that they had to then use that knowledge to create their own spy gadget. So they were evaluated not only on their writing, but on their creativity. And they worked with their partners to design a gadget that if they were a spy, they would want to use in the field that would protect their secrecy, would give them the features they needed, and help them gain the intelligence for their government. Remember, do not talk about which one's yours, and you may not vote for yourself. When the project was complete, the students judged each other. They rated each gadget on its design, its features, and how secretive it was. When the scores were tallied, Mrs. Blackwood announced the winners. You ready? First winner is Time Machine by Delilah and Vera. There's good. I'm going to make you go to the front. All right. And the second one was yeah. Strategic Heal by Tara. All the design winners received breakfast from Miss Blackwood. We're going to let our two top design teams tell you about their projects. The project is basically a time machine, but it's like a spear, like it won't, it's not like a actual time machine, but it's just like the thing you can like carry around and it will like take you wherever you want to go. Like if you like think about it, like, where you're, like wherever you want to go, like it'll take you. Yeah. And it's like manageable because it's small and like, it's like easy for you to like carry around. Yeah and not look like suspicious. And so Miss Blackwood, she wanted us to make a, a gadget for us to um, have like a spy thing. So like we would have to make a gadget like to spy on other people. So that was like basically the whole concept. And we made a time machine because that's like you could like see like who did a crime or like who did whatever and like who's associated with it. So yeah, and find out who did it or to help the person before they die. Yeah, basically like that, yeah. The project that we designed is called an extravagant heel and it's used for like when we like if you have an event to go to and you're being spy for that event, you could wear it for like, for us girls, we will wear dresses most likely, and you can make the heel like a perfect accessory for it. Um, the, one of my favorite things about this heel is that, um, there's multiple, um, accessories in a way. Mm -hmm. um, they, for example, there's a bullet holder to store bullets, <laughs> um, a tracker, a, the strap of the hill is a whip, and there's a, the zipper is a butterfly knife. And we added all these accessories, so like if we're in big danger, we'll have like a bunch of weapons mm -hmm. to like use so that we don't get hurt or anything. Mm -hmm. Um. Part of this is that like we can protect ourselves from em enemy, uh, enemies and like, I don't know what else. Um, um, you can, it's mostly used for protection, but like if you were a spy in danger, I think it would be very helpful. It would be very, very helpful.
like there's a tracker that you can like when you take the heel it's kind of it comes into an explosive grenade once you take that tracker out you throw the grenade so you can make a quick escape and like place the tracker on something so that way you can track your enemy mm -hmm. um we kind of we got this idea from i th think it was a james bond movie maybe or maybe i don't know i thought <laughs> i think i got the idea from a james bond movie and then we just kind of put it together and was like okay mm -hmm. <laughs> and we used a little idea i forgot who the name was but we used it as like if so we could we could color it out at the bottom i think it was it was something baton or something. Uh, i think it was christian louboutin oh yeah because yeah, their yeah. heels like his designer heels go in red at the yeah. end of part so that would look really good with whatever dress you're wearing mm -hmm. look out folks the next 007 might come from right here in clover middle school Thanks for watching episode 16, Making an Impact with 8th Grade Secret Agents.